Travel Updates for International Students In today's video update, we will talk about the international students who still need quarantine plan at Canada border, as announced by IRCC. The Government of Canada is prompting international students of border measures before fall semester. Even though Canada has commenced easing border measures, having a quarantine plan is still obligated, at the border even if you don't really utilize it. The good news is that, fully vaccinated travelers no longer have to quarantine, for two weeks. From beginning of the 9th of August 2021, if you are fully vaccinated, you no longer need an on-arrival test, unless you get casually selected. Canada presently only considers you to be fully vaccinated, if it has been 14 days since you got the final dose of a vaccine that has been authorized by Health Canada. These presently include Pfizer, Moderna, AstraZeneca, and Janssen. Or else, you are still believed unvaccinated. The, the 9th of August 2021 also marks the end of hotel quarantine, where passengers have to pay to stay in a government-authorized hotel. Nevertheless, you still have to show up to the border with a suitable quarantine plan just in case the Canadian border officer decides you do not fulfill the exemption. The federal government issued a presser, especially for international students arriving to Canada this fall, reminding them of what they are required to do in order to travel to Canada. Now let's tell you who can enter Canada to study. Please keep in mind that, there are two things that you need, in order to come to Canada as a student. A valid study permit, or letter of introduction that demonstrates, you have been authorized for a study permit, and be registered in a designated learning institution, that has a COVID-19 readiness plan. You can get the most latest list on the government website. Students coming from India, will have to suffer because of the ban on direct flights. Canada has postponed direct flights between the two countries until at least the 21st of August 2021. Those passengers coming from India can take an indirect route, but will require a pre-departure COVID-19 test from a third country before arriving into Canada. What are the updates on quarantine plan? Please keep in mind that, you must already have a plan to cope the quarantine period, for international students as part of its COVID-19 readiness plan. The plan must also allow you access to food, and medicine during your stay. It is highly advised that, you get in touch with your school for help in developing your quarantine plan, before you come to Canada. Subsequently, you have to provide your plan to border officials through the Arrive Can app. This mobile app has been utilized throughout the COVID-19 pandemic for officer traveler communication, and it is where you provide all the documents you will need for travel. Again, you will still require a quarantine plan, even if you are considered fully vaccinated. Your proof of vaccination must be in English or French, or else you will be needing a certified translation. More changes in rules expected. Health officials are currently monitoring the COVID-19 situation in Canada and around the globe. Any modifications to border measures falls under Health Canada's responsibility. Other departments, for example the Canadian border, works to implement the health department's recommendations. While international travel limitations fall under the federal government's range, provincial governments are accountable for their own healthcare systems. The federal government offers a list of each provincial government's website, which include rules for travelers. Your learning institution will also have its own COVID rules and regulations. This is the end of today's video update. If you found this video useful, then please share it with your friends and family on Facebook, WhatsApp, and Twitter. Thanks for watching.